wanted to do something different for my birthday. So what I'll be doing is pretty much do a bit of a life update here where I am, which is in France with my family and just life while I do makeup. Follow with me if you will and let's catch up. I'll write down below what products that I'll be using. Hopefully if I get to keep track and my BB cushion is almost running out. I don't like putting a whole face of foundation. I'm not a fan of full coverage. Though I used to do full coverage when if say I would perform. If you don't know, I used to be a dancer for a little over 10 years so yeah i actually filmed this about two or three days before my birthday currently we are in lockdown here in nui source nui source girl i'm not even gonna but yeah that's the city that or little town that we live in it's just like two train stops away from Paris. 20 minute walk. <laughs> this is the apartment that we found because Paris is freaking expensive to live in. So I'm gonna start with my concealer just for my eyes. The lockdown that we have is basically uh, we're allowed one hour outside and we cannot go beyond one kilometer radius away from our residence say if you go jogging that's how far you can go or you just go around in circle and that's not much of a problem either for most people here because there's like groceries every two to three blocks so everyone has access to food and pharmacies pharmacies i think there's about three just in or five pharmacies within the one kilometer kilometer radius that we live in so i'm gonna set this with my favorite it's the innisfree as you can see it's pretty much rubbed off so sometimes i don't really like to mention the makeup i use i i just label it sometimes in the description i have a reason for that because with whatever makeup i use whoever watches my tutorials I want them to use what they have because this is what I used to do when I would watch makeup tutorials is what is I would look at what I have and the closest thing I have of theirs because at that time I was high school or in college I couldn't afford makeup I couldn't afford to buy what they had and some of them were expensive so if you're a viewer of mine and if you're watching one of my videos i'll keep repeating this that use what you have as closest to the shade of mine and yeah let's just go from there because it's just a deep story or a deep thing to talk about but yeah so going back to the lockdown it's it's been kind of kind of lonely because the fact that I thought things were gonna be okay from the lockdown from March, but apparently the cases here drastically went up. A lot of people went into critical condition and a lot of people passed away. The hospitals are overwhelmed again. The summer went by and people were very excited because what I've learned here is that vacations is quite sacred to people here in France. So when it's summertime, it's travel time. That's that's when they go to the beach, they go to another country, they go somewhere else and take a day off, uh, take weeks of vacation off actually. Usually this is what I hear from my husband at work is August is usually a ghost month. It's when most of them go on vacation for a whole entire month. Two weeks or three weeks, that's how long they go on vacation. And that's paid vacation by the way, if you must know. So they're very, very lucky here. I guess that's a cause too. People were sick and tired of the lockdown and when they had the chance to be free, that caused gatherings and stuff and you causing t you not wearing your mask. Voila, you're virus. <laughs> 
going to use this color. Currently, my son is two years and four months old. We were actually supposed to put him in a daycare because I believe that's where he'll learn how to speak French naturally. And also that allows me a bit of free time to do a lot more things and also work. So I'm going to take Dark Horse, this one. So basically I'm just doing my part on helping him learn things and he loves ABCs. I have little flashcards for him so he knows a lot of animals. <laughs> and the sounds of it. It's really cute. It's hard to get it on camera though. He knows when it's on and he gets curious and wants to play with the camera. I'm getting used to the life of living with two boys. They love to wrestle. My son loves to wrestle and I cannot keep up. Like, I want to keep my hair long, but he's making me want to cut it because he pulls it all the time or sometimes unintentionally because two-year-olds are just naturally sticky everywhere no matter how much you clean them. All right, so I'm going to take my favorite shade. It's gold and it just matches with everything. I've been pretty much loving and obsessing about BTS because they've been such an inspiration lately and they just make you feel really nice and excited and motivated. And so far, I'm very, very excited for their new album to come out. And I've been watching and catching up on their run, BTS, and it's just really fun to see them being silly and laughing and you just laugh along with them. They're just like your friends. You know, if you're a newbie ARMY, you have so much to catch up on. It's not even funny how much content they have. Of all the groups that I've been loving before, like SHINee or like Big Bang, it's like they didn't have this much content. Oh, and please let me know who your biases are because honestly for me, I love them all. Like they are just so cute, not just because of their looks, but they're all so talented and they're just so unique and I get it. I get why they have this, why people love them so much. Their music's amazing too. It's meaningful, it's uplifting, it's so relatable. So far my favorites are JK and Shoga. Shoga? I relate to so much. I feel like we're the same <laughs> in terms of like with my friends that love BTS, they think I am Shoga. <laughs> like this this whole talking thing to the camera i'd prefer like voiceover or just silence <laughs> what i've been missing aside from going out is the philippines i miss the philippines because we used to live there and i lived there for the last 10 years of my life before pretty much since college yep that's how old i am and yes by the time you see this i'll be 32 years old I miss the Philippines so much. The food, my family, the f people, my friends, just even familiarity in general because I miss just speaking Tagalog. I miss ordering food without, you know, sign language or like hand gestures or pointing, you know, I just say what I want. And actually, I've been really sad because of the typhoon and it, it just caused so much mayhem in the Philippines and I do have family in Marikina but they live in Parang so it's not that it's not close to the river and I believe it's a little bit high up. I will link down below where if you would like more information about it donations would be highly appreciative. Do your research as well because there are a lot of scams. A lot of people are suffering. It's just one after the other and it, I know it's not just the Philippines but you know this is what's close to my heart and that's what's happening right now and I hope that you can help. That's pretty much it for my birthday and I'll just be staying home the whole time enjoy it with my family. I'm not sad. 
but I'm not exactly excited, not because of me aging, but human interaction is, is a huge thing. And I guess being Filipino, you celebrate everything, especially your birthday. It's just a little sad, I'm not gonna lie, because we've been at this all for over six months and we'll just have to wait for the safety of others and yourselves. <laughs> You know, when I look out the window, I don't want to shoot them, but just because it's their privacy. Everyone is going to the grocery and when they come back, it's like super full. So everyone's just stocking up because they can't go out too much. That's my look for today, for my birthday. And I hope you like that little chat that we did. And yeah let's just connect comment down below press that like button so i know that this is something that you like and please do subscribe because i would like to really build a community that's just passionate about makeup or is interested in makeup and also being able to talk about topics about motherhood that's just what i like to talk about and get into hit that subscribe button and i'll see you guys soon and happy birthday to me <laughs> yay <laughs> all right guys i'll see you soon bye